Hello everybody, welcome to Adventures in Beekeeping. Today we're at the Honey and Bee Connection in Moorhead, Kentucky. And we have with us today Jim, one of the proprietors here. Jim, how are you doing? Pretty good. Come on in, we'll go around and show you what we've got going on in here. We started, we started the business back in uh, 2009 and have expanded three or four different times. Uh, we carry a full line of beekeeping supplies and equipment. Um, everything uh, we have here, we'll go, we'll go around and I'll give you a little tour of the store. We started carrying seed, different seeds this year, carrying all kinds of different clovers, any kind of pollinator mixes. Seeds, seeds to that effect. Um, carry gloves, pretty much about anything we need to buy of beekeeping supplies. That's Paula over there. <laughs> Hi, Paula. Hello. This year, because but we carry all the uh, different medications for mite treatments, uh, for beetle control, all that kind of stuff. Carry a full line of jackets, vented, unvented. Uh, and coveralls. We also sell honey, candles, a lot of queen rearing equipment right over there. And then in here, we're a dealer for Sivan. We're a dealer for Sivan and uh, Maxent honey extraction equipment. Um, we're also dealers for uh, JZ or JZBZ for queen rearing equipment, Jester Easy Nukes. Here they come. <laughs> That's not a bee. No. <laughs> um, we carry uh, pretty much all the contain different size containers uh, for honey processing, fume boards, bee quick, smokers, hive tools. Uh, we're dealer for acorn foundation. Uh, we all the thing we do carry on acorn is a double wax coated uh, wooden carry full line woodenware. Manufacture a lot of that ourselves. Um, different, uh, the fit wax and, and plastic foundation. And like I said before, we're a dealer for acorn. The only thing we carry on acorn is their double wax. If you want single wax, we don't carry it. Uh, carry all different flavors of frames. We have equipment assembled, unassembled, whichever way you want it. Everything we assemble is put together with tight bond three wood glue and screws. If you can put screws in it, everything we paint, all the painted equipment is two coats of paint. Yeah. So it's a real good heavy, heavy outdoor grade paint. Um, and honey processing equipment, we carry all the, the heated uncapping knives, yeah, capping yeah. scratchers, uh, different uh, honey gates and hive tools, pretty much about anything you need in the way of beekeeping. We're probably about the only place in the eastern half of Kentucky that has a full line bee store in the eastern, east of I-75 in Kentucky. Um, we've been at it since 2009 and just steadily grow year after year. We just started carrying a seven line of equi bee extracting equipment. That's a Max, Max G made by seven. Uh, a little bit of we carry Maxon equipment. And then, uh, any questions? You have any questions for me? What would you give to? As advice for the beginning beekeeper, read, read and learn all you can learn before you get your bees. Prepare early because bees are hard to come by. Come at March, April, May when you're wanting, when it's time to start working your bees, get into it early. Um, plan on, I, tell, I say, I have three things that I tell people. There's three things that kill honeybees, three main things, varroa mites, Moisture problems and starvation in the winter, and beekeepers. And if the, they take care, the beekeeper takes care of the varroa mites and takes care of the moisture and the feeding and making sure their bees are built up in the winter, pretty much takes the beekeeper out of the question. Still going to lose bees, but you won't lose near as many. Um, okay. Always start off with two hives of bees. If you're going to be keeping bees, if you're a new new beekeeper, start off with two. It makes it a lot easier if you have a problem to make to to correct the problem 
or at least things that alleviate the problem to the point and give you a little more time to get the problem corrected. Like if you go cleanless or something, you can add frames of brood, something like that. So two hives, that makes for a good comparison measure. That's two of the things, that's one of the things that I see that's, uh, that a lot of people make a mistake on. They just do one hive of bees and then when they have a problem, they have no way of fixing it. I see. So if I if somebody wanted to start in 2022, they should start reading now. Start reading learning now. all they can. And if you are close to the Moorhead area, or even if you want to drive an hour or two, call us, and we you're more than welcome to come out. We've got bees all over the place, and we'll be more than happy to take you out to a bee yard, be, uh, down to the bee yard, and go through bees with you, and teach you a little bit. An hour or two will make a big difference in your experience level. When you first get your bees so we do that all the time a couple weeks ago we had about 40 people here for a field day we went down and made splits combined hives added queens uh went through a couple hives that were queenless one that had a laying worker and it gives people the experience of being able to see this stuff firsthand rather than reading about it in a book and looking at it in a book i don't know about everybody else but i do a lot better if i can see it rather than just read about it and look at a picture but that, that offer is always open here at the Honey and Bee Connection for you to come in and spend a couple hours in a bee yard when we're working bees. Just got to call and make sure we're going to be working bees that day. I have two people wanting to come in today. It's been raining. We canceled out because it's just not fun working bees in the rain. Right, right. So, well, that's a really great offer. That's, but we that's do that excellent. all the time for people. Nice. Very good. So, Very good. But if you get over around more headway, stop in and see us. Uh, we're off of I-64, about four and a half miles on Cranston Road, or Route 377. Uh, our phone, our website is www.thehoneyandbeeconnection, or you can give us a call at 606-784-3108, or you can get reach me on my cell at 606-207-7785. Thank you, Jim and Paula, for letting us do a mini tour of your store the Honey and Bee Connection in Moorhead, Kentucky. Thank you so much. That's all I have for today. Thank you for watching. God bless and have a great day.